think for a moment about what it means to feel right. It means that you think that your beliefs just perfectly reflect reality. And when you feel that way, you've got a problem to solve, which is how are you going to explain all of those people who disagree with you? It turns out most of us explain those people the same way, by resorting to a series of unfortunate assumptions. The first thing we usually do when someone disagrees with us is we just assume they're ignorant. You know, they don't, they don't have access to the same information that we do, and when we generously share that information with them, they're going to see the light and come on over to our team. When that doesn't work, when it turns out those people have all the same facts that we do and they still disagree with us, then we move on to a second assumption, which is that they're idiots. <laughs> they have all the right pieces of the puzzle and they are too moronic to put them together correctly. <coughs> and when that doesn't work, when it turns out that people who disagree with us have all the same facts we do and are actually pretty smart, then we move on to a third assumption. They know the truth, and they are deliberately distorting it for their own malevolent purposes. <laughs> so this is a catastrophe. This attachment to our own rightness keeps us from preventing mistakes when we absolutely need to, and causes us to treat each other terribly. But you know, to me, what's most baffling and most tragic about this is that it misses the whole point of being human. You know, it's like we want to imagine that our minds are just these perfectly translucent windows, and we just kind of gaze out of them and describe the world as it unfolds. And we want everybody else to gaze out of the same window and see the exact same thing.